Gunnison may not be the largest town in our state, but whatever they lack in size, they make up for with heart. The power of this small community's love is on display, and it's all to help Jackson Hill, so he and his family know they aren't alone. We live in a great place, my friend. What you see here is what happens when a community comes together. Just while we've been talking to you, I've had two texts that two more donations that were over $1,000. All these donated items will be auctioned. The money raised will support Jackson Hill. I think it's pretty cool. Jackson, who's better known as Jacko, has a condition called spinal meningioma. Non-cancerous tumors growing in his spinal cord. He's enduring chemotherapy and radiation to remove those tumors, which have taken away his ability to walk. When I was healthy, I kind of always was the kind of kid to push myself to, uh, I guess, be better in, in, in whatever whatever sport it was. Now Jacko, who started in basketball and track at Gunnison Valley High, is pushing himself to walk. Jackson's one tough dude. He's the, he's the toughest guy I know. This community in central Utah is right there with this high school senior and his family as they take on this challenge with so many unknowns. It's actually amazing, the, the support that we received. Jacko isn't in this alone. If you had asked me 20 years ago if I would be raising my children in a community this small, I would have told you you were crazy. But this is exactly where I want to raise my kids. His neighbors, friends, even strangers. They want to meet him and they want to support him even though they don't know him. Giving so much more than the tumors can ever take away. I take pride in doing that. That's, that's where I come from. If you missed tonight's auction, you can still help. There are several ways you can donate. We have those links on our website at fox13now.com. In the newsroom, John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah.